What's good? It's me, J. King, a.k.a. Coach OG. Shout out to all my OGs, OHG, O-Head Gang. Shout out to the IQ Ballers and the Clamp Camp. Got another replica bill. We got CD Clax, Speedy, excuse me, Speedy Claxton. You know what I'm saying? Bill's name will be called Speedy. If y'all don't know, this is one. He was called Speedy because he was fast. The boy was quick. I mean, fast, fast. You hit me. <laughs> but anyway, man, let's get into it. Choose whatever name you choose. Royalty in my name. So, King, it is. The position is point guard, a.k.a. point guard. Right-handed and jersey number 12. Then we'll go 5'11 on the height. 175 on the weight, 6'4 on the wingspan, I choose whatever body shape you choose, but you know me real life gym rest, so I'm going with Defined. 75 on the close shot, 83 on the driving layup, giving us 13 finishing badges. Then we're going to jump down to shooting, 74 on the mid range, we ain't got much of a three ball at all, he's not really here for the shooting. So we got 49 three ball at 84 free throw, giving us 7 shooting badges. We got a decent mid range though, but... You know what I'm saying? Enough to make the mid-range. So you can still space the floor, but you ain't got much of a three ball. Now, here's the bread and butter right here, the playmaking. We got an 88 pass accuracy, 88 ball handle, and 93 speed with ball. Like I said, the boy is fast. So, 27 playmaking badges. Now, going down to defense, we got a 77 perimeter defense, 84 steal, 55 block, 61 offensive rebound, and 53 defensive rebound for 19 defensive badges now going down to the physicals once again like i said the boy is fast we got a 95 speed and acceleration 35 strength 85 vert surprisingly we got an 85 vert no dunk but hey you know what i'm saying 2k for you you know what i'm saying 85 vert and a 90 stamina as far as takes we get the shot creating takes play takes and lock takes i want with ankle breaking shots and perimeter badge drops but you know what I'm saying? You can choose whatever take you want. It would not affect the build name. Just pick what fits your style. We got every Johnson, Fred Van Vliet, and Trey Young. Um, I think it's pretty pretty accurate. Both those, those are all pretty pretty fast players. So I guess uh I don't know so much about Avery Johnson. I didn't get a chance to really watch Avery Johnson, you know what I'm saying? That's I don't know how fast he was. But he looked like he was pretty fast though, you know what I'm saying? When you look at Avery, Avery Johnson, he looked like he was pretty fast, you know what I'm saying? AKA a little general. That's another replica build that I did put out by the way. But let's uh, get into these baddies. All right, of course, we're going to go Hall of Fame on the uh, Giant Slayer. Uh, we got getting into tier three unless you decide to use your your, your uh, badges from your Rogue to the League challenge. You know what I'm saying? Your plus four. Otherwise, we just going to keep it simple. Uh, might as well go silver on that. And then uh, let's say... Um, we ain't got much strength, so you ain't gonna be doing too much on the back and down side. Uh, let's go Aerial Wizard. Uh, then we'll core the Fast Twitch. Um, yeah, this is a toughie, toughie. Uh, she could post spin. Oh, you know what? I say go ahead and time your layups. Use that Pro Touch. Time your layups, man. It's your best bet, you know what I'm saying? Time your layups and you'll you'll actually get more, just get it down. I actually time my layups and I don't even have to use a meter either. Give me even more of a boost. So just a just a thought, you know what I'm saying? My little suggestion. But uh, I'm gonna go gold on the mini magician off the break. Um I'm a core here, because once there's another one, uh the only one you're gonna be able to get anything on tier three is the playmaking, you know what I'm saying? That's your bread and butter. But uh, I'm a core the space creator here. Um uh, like I said, well, Green Machine, Mini Magician on gold, both those on gold, and then my fat, let's go Claymore. So Claymore on, on bronze as well. And uh, yeah, that'll do it right there. That works. Gonna play maker, like I said, the bread and butter right here. Uh, let's go bronze on the needle threader. Uh, let's go bronze on the hyperdrive. Let's go bell out bronze. Let's go Hall of Fame on the quick first step. Let's jump down. Let's get. Uh, gold clamp breaker. Uh, let's go bronze on the handle for days. Uh, let's go gold on the unpluckable. Um, let's go floor general, hall of fame, and that'll do it right there. You know what I'm saying for my team players right there. 
You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of people don't like don't like dimer, so I, that's why you don't you notice I don't put dimer on anymore. But I feel like you can't go wrong with a uh, floor general though. You know what I'm saying? I, I kind of prefer floor general over dimer because if you're a real team player, dimer is for when the ball is coming from your hand. Floor general will get in the boost regardless. So I actually preference that because I don't. It's not about when it comes from my hand. I play with randoms. It is about when it comes from my hand though. I'm really. I really, you know, play it more for me, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, they not playing for me, so, you know what I'm saying? It, it is what it is. Uh, LeBron's on the chase down. LeBron's on the post lockdown. So LeBron's on the rebound chaser. Actually, I lied. I said you only get t uh, tier three on the playmaking. You do get it on the defense, too. Um, so let's go silver on the ankle braces. Um, let's go bronze. Silver. I'm trying to think how I guess, I guess you can kind of go. Uh, let's go gold on the ankle braces. Keep that as silver. There we go. We got the 10 we need. Um, so that's core interceptor on silver. Let's get clamp in there. Oh, this would be a good one to have one, one more badge. That way you can get that bronze. Uh, get that bronze glove. But, you know, it is what it is. Uh, we ain't gonna get nothing down there. So, we got, I guess we can go back up here. I wouldn't be... I would, if you have a lock in your team, I definitely would go for the uh, off-ball pass. But uh, if you don't have a lock, then I would go with the pick dodger. You know what I'm saying? There you have it, man. We got Speedy Claxton, a.k.a. Speedy, you know what I'm saying? It's a decent build. It's definitely playable. Uh, but, you know, we put out much better replica builds. There's definitely much better rep replica builds out there. A lot of people say these replica builds ain't playable. But y'all already know how we do it over here. You know what I'm saying? All my ballers. Y'all know y'all know how we do it over here. They keep saying that these replica builds suck. They're not playable. But we we didn't prove that wrong several times, man. So... Yeah, say I appreciate y'all for showing me that love. Y'all know what we do, man. Y'all know what it is, man. Shout out to all my OGs, OHG, old head gang. Shout out to the IQ ballers in the clamp camp. Y'all know what to do. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And please hit that noty bell as well. And y'all know the motto. Don't be toxic. Let's ball.